update. And welcome all to the 2 p.m. update here at TFNN with me, David White. So we've got a market that is pretty much doing what we were looking for, at least what I was looking for. We talked about it yesterday, and that is if you bounce instantly, that's probably not a low. You always want, if you can, uh, to get a uh, market to retest that low. Uh, if you're bullish, you want to see it on lighter volume. If you're bearish, you want about the same volume, maybe a little bit more. Uh, if you think it's a short-term bottom, then you want to see a huge amount of volume. Uh, and that uh, pretty much puts in a selling climax, which is a short-term low into the market. That's probably, again, going to get retested. So the big question, uh, and we'll go through it in the show here in a little bit, is taking a look at the volumes and what those volumes look like in the different ETFs and overall uh, through the uh, uh, market as a whole. So we are doing some fairly decent volume, about six point, excuse me, about 9.4 billion shares so far on the day with two hours left. Now, to blow out the lows, we'd need about $16 billion. Right now, we're probably set for about $14 billion shares on the day. So this would be a retest on not a whole lot lighter, but lighter volume. And, of course, you really want to uh, take a look at going through the um, other ETFs like the SPIES and see whether or not the volume in those is saying the same thing. It's not uncommon, especially in these big moves, uh, to see uh, what is uh, a lot of volume in the indexes. You get to the ETFs, you find they're not even close to that. So if we go back to uh, in the Wayback Machine, uh, a couple days ago, we had 157 million shares in the spies. Today, just 88 million, 89 million so far. So maybe a temporary low. See you in a few minutes for the show. Mm -hmm. 